Memorial Day also marks the biggest driving holiday of the year. Nearly 1.2 million Virginians alone will be traveling despite those rising gas prices. And 10 News reporter Allison Wickline hit the road today to see how travelers are keeping up and paying up. Allison? Well, gas prices haven't been this high heading into the holiday weekend since 2014, but that isn't stopping millions from still hitting the road. I haven't even looked to see what the gas prices are. Steve Nichols is gassing up oh, before he heads to the lake for Memorial Day weekend. We generally don't go on Memorial Weekend, but uh, we just lucked out and got some camping reservations, so we're going. He's expecting traffic. Just going to take my time and drive slow and careful. I'm off today and Monday, so I'm no hurry. And also paying more at the pump. We're prepared, but I uh, don't like it. I mean, it's a pretty good chunk of change. Steve is one of the 41.5 million Americans expected to hit the road this weekend. That's the highest number of travelers in more than 12 years and 5% more than last year. There's been a lot of traffic. There hadn't really been a whole lot of slowdowns other than the uh, where the truck had caught on fire. Um, but there's a lot of there's a lot of state troopers out, a lot of cops out. Outside Knoxville was horrible. We got stuck for an hour and a half last night going maybe five miles. It was horrible. Besides traffic stalls and stops, many travelers will be feeling pain at the pump as gas prices are the highest they've been in four years. Right now, the national average sits around $2.97 per gallon. Gas prices are definitely up a little bit higher than usual, um, so you definitely want to add that into your, your budget. However, the economy is pretty strong right now and people are feeling confident, so that's not stopping people from traveling. The average gas price in the Commonwealth sits at about 276, and here in Roanoke, it's at about 267. Live in Roanoke, Allison Wickline, 10 News, working for you.